Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Real Suffolk FC. Today's match is against Margaret Catchpole in the first round of the MCS Cup. Starting off in goal today, we have Dale Nock. Actually a centre-back, but in goal for us today. In the defence, in left-back we have James Eid, and in right-back we have Rhys Heyman, with the centre-backs being Jamie Pope and Bailey Garahan. The three in the midfield today are Cornell O'Connor, Ben Garrett and Matty Thompson. And up front today we have Curtis Burnett on the right wing, Liam Moisey on the left wing and Kane at Webster through the middle. 4-3-3 formation, Chris Cook is overseeing today's match. Substitutes are Rich Howler, myself, Will Stein and Mental. Catchpole in the silver, Real Suffolk in the orange and red. About to get underway here. Catchpole now with a goal kick. One by Matty and flicked on. Then number 12 now, putting the pressure on. Still with the ball at his feet. Forces a save from Dale. Also using his feet. Big goal kick from Dale now. Bounces all the way through. Moisey coming through now. Putting the shoulder in. And it's a loopy flick over the top. Missed by the defender. Through on goal. Unfortunately just put wide there. Real Suffolk now with a throw in. Flicked on by Curtis there. Neat little flick through there. On the counter. Pope. Losing out there to the attacker. Coming through on goal again. Forcing another save from Dale. Catch pole now with a goal kick. Oh, it's a missed kick by Pope there. Through on goal once again. And he hit the post. And Bailey comes across to block the second shot there. Lucky to not concede there. Catch pole now with the corner. Great save from Dale there. Down low to his left. And now Real Suffolk looking to hit on the counter attack with Liam Moisey. Playing it through for Curtis. Who might get on the end of it. Unfortunately, it gets muscled off the ball. Late in the half now. Catch pole have got a throw in. Cornell steps in. Going into half time now, if you haven't already, please make sure you like the video, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss an upload. Make sure you also follow all of our socials which are in the top line of the description and on screen now. Real Suffolk now, getting ready to kick off in the second half. It's catch pole with a free kick on the edge of the box. The ball comes in and finds its way through to Dale's hands. Dale distributes the ball to Will there. Catch pole now with the ball. Playing it long and back to the hands of Dale there. It's another long kick. Real Suffolk now putting the pressure on. And Kane giving away the foul there. Catch pole now with a free kick. It's taken now. Flicked over the goalie there. And a penalty has been given. Dale came rushing out of goal. And collides with the man, giving away a penalty. Catch pole now with the penalty. 
and it is 1-0 to Catchpole unfortunately conceding the penalty there back underway now Dale with a long kick upfield cleared out by their defenders one and brought down by Heyman into the feet of Matty Catchpole now looking to counter Pope intercepting and playing it up forward to Kane who plays the ball through to Curti he pushes the man off the ball and calmly puts it into the bottom left corner to make it 1-0 let's get another look at that see Pope intercepts there plays a little deft touch over to Kane who plays it low and through to Curtis and we see Curtis just passing the ball into the, the bottom left corner there great finish there catch pole now on the attack playing it low forcing a save from Dale and it's a flick over and Heyman is thankfully back on the line to clear it off catch pole now with the ball played out wide and it's played through and it appears he's offside but unfortunately the lino hasn't flagged it and the goal is given 2-1-2 to catch pole really unfortunate there that the lino couldn't see that he was offside Dale now going up for a goal uh, for a free kick sorry and uh, our usual free kick taker is not very happy uh, that our goalie is coming up to take it but uh, hopefully Dale can produce something spectacular from this it's hit and it finds its way into the back of the net to make it 2 all. Dale with an amazing free kick there. Showing exactly why he should be stood over free kicks from that kind of distance. Let's get another look at that. Stood over the free kick. Absolutely blasts it to the keeper's right and he just has to watch it go in. Absolutely stunning free kick from Dale there. Ball is sent long. Callie misses the flick. Puts the pressure on the man and actually wins the ball back there. It's holding up the play. And it's gone out there for a goal kick. Dale now sending it long. Cali now spinning out down the line and crossing it in. Unfortunately, Kane can't get on the end of it. It's a great cross from Cali there. Will now on the ball, getting at the foul for that little push there. Dale once again in that kind of position. Can he produce another amazing free kick here? hit and it hits the wall Cornell with the ball holding it up there and stepping out of the man Cali now with the ball Kane and it's been called offside there not too sure about that one catch ball now playing a long ball over the top See Edie tracking back there and throwing in a great challenge there and myself just knocking it out of play. Late in the half now. Cornell unfortunately gives the ball away and it's a great interception by Bailey. Cleared by Edie. Still playing on. Will with the ball now. Through to Cali. Unfortunately, straight at the keeper. 
And that is full time. The final score being 2 all. That is really good performance from the lads against the Division 2 side. So we are happy to come up with the draw there. If you haven't already, please make sure you like the video, share it around, subscribe, hit the bell icon so you never miss an upload. Follow all of our socials which are in the top line of the description. I've been James, aka The Bone Crusher. You've been amazing. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.